Mr. Charlot. I'm Gertrude Lawrence, and I've come all the way from there. I do not employ undisciplined amateurs. This is the vaudeville theater, not Margate Pier. If the lady's naughty but proper, if the lady's chicer than chic, if her escorts must wear a topper, and each man's the man of the week, if she rides around in a brand new foreign car, the chances are the lady's a star. I'm Bert. Perhaps you've heard of me, Bert. You've had word of me jogging along, hearty and strong, living on plates of fresh air. Sing. Gay! Piccadilly, Piccadilly, where the traffic goes one way. In the daytime, they parade down the street, but at night time, they come on the street of Piccadilly. up to you, G. Always has been. Yes. I love you. You know that. Oh, Mr. Aldridge, there is absolutely nothing you could do or say at this moment which would make me laugh. Marry me. My ship has sails that are made of silk. The decks are trimmed with gold. Now we haven't got a penny for the you know what has anybody seen? 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 Anybody? 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 Anybody seen? Burlington Bertie from Bath. Not now, Noel. Yes, Gertie. Now. This isn't a pretty little part you're playing. It's deadly earnest. If you don't face up to this responsibility, you will go to jail. and infuriating, but she's also the most beautiful and entrancing creature ever to walk onto a stage. No. No, you can't. Gertrude. I can't do it. Please, don't desert her. Pick a dilly. Pick a dilly. Rings on your fingers and tears for your crown. Someday. Fortunately, my darling, you can't take a whole audience home to bed without being accused of immorality on rather a grand scale. <laughs> <laughs>